Hey everybody, Jay here. Welcome back to the channel. As I always do, I would like to give a shout out to, I believe, a new subscriber I have, uh, Ontario Firewood Resource. You commented on my woodshed video and you said you subscribed to the channel. So yes, welcome to the homestead. Appreciate you tuning in. Anyways, we got a little quick video for you today. Uh, a Husqvarna 240. Let me grab it here. Um, yeah, you probably don't recognize it now. Um, <laughs> so I didn't film this, but I was looking for an... Um, uh, my subscribers, when I got the, when I uh, the video I posted on the Husqvarna 240 originally, um, I said there was no adjustment on the high and the low. But uh, come to find out, you needed a specialty tool. Now the other one, two, three, four, five, six chainsaws I have, you can use a regular flathead. But on this, it was a really particular um, splined screwdriver here. So thank you guys for pointing that out. But anyways, searching for that on Amazon, I end up getting a whole new carb. Uh, fuel line, fuel filter, air filter, literally a full tune-up kit spark plug for $20 for the Husqvarna 240 here. We've got a, a top cover here, as you can see, we were missing our top cover. If you guys are just joining us, uh, this saw uh, came from the dump and my buddy Adam gave it to me. Uh, so yes, what we did was we put a cover on it. We got that on eBay, $10 on eBay, free shipping for a cover. Um, so we have $10 into it, plus we have $30 into this. Right hand on the Bible, I have not ran this yet. We put fuel in it. I wanted to share it with you guys. So what we're gonna do is, is uh, we're gonna grab our headphones. We're gonna see if this baby will run with a brand new carb on it. I'm curious to see what it'll do. We still haven't fixed the chain brake, but I wanted to see how well the saw ran first. Uh, and if it runs good, it's gonna join us on our, uh, it's gonna join the bench with its brothers and sisters to be part of the chainsaw arsenal. So yeah. <laughs> Let's go ahead and prime this. I love that Echo Red Armor. I can literally, nice and red. All right, so choke. Oh, that's cool. When you pull the choke out, it, it knocks the kill switch off. See, that's why I, I love all types of engines, motors, cars. I'm not just set on one brand. Everything has its little quirks, and, and that's what's fun. That's what I like about it. So anyways, all right, we got kill switch up, choke, we primed it. Let's see, uh, see what it does. Don't try this at home. <laughs> I'm gonna adjust the high. I, you, I don't know if you heard, it was kind of bogging out a little bit, so. I'm gonna adjust the high, got it really clamped tight in the vise. Don't try this at home, okay?
that sounds all right. We won't really, we can fine tune it once we get in the wood, but uh, yeah, this little spline specialty tool, that's good. Uh, this thing's oiling like a pig. So anyways, um, yeah, I'm happy with that. We can go ahead. Now it's time. I'm gonna shoot, try to shoot this in one, one take. It's just easier on the editing, so bear with me. But anyways, we are going to join this saw right next to the home light. That runs pretty good. Once we stick it in with some wood, we'll know how it's really doing. Well, I think that looks pretty good. <laughs> Now it's got a new home. So that's pretty cool. So anyways, let's wrap up here. Um, appreciate you guys watching. Again, just spending a little time out in the saw shed. Nothing wrong with that. It smells like two stroke. It's a beautiful day out. Um, warm weather is on the way. Oh my goodness, it's already like 45 degrees. It's supposed to be like 60 out the next couple days. It's insane. So anyways, yep, we got the husk barner running. We'll really stick it in some wood uh, when we get some wood to cut. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have nothing to cut right now. So yes, we'll take it out in the woods the next time we go on a firewood adventure. And yes, we will see how it does. Um, got this off for free, spent $30 on it. Not bad, right? $20 card kit, $10 cover, probably an hour's worth of work. So yeah, I'm happy with it. Again, it's just another saw to add to the collection. So anyways, like I always say, my name is Jay. Appreciate you guys watching. Let me know what you think. Please leave a comment and yeah, we will see you out in the woods.